Ah! Pretty sure there's at least a couple of times when you left some fountains undrained. Probably. I just didn't realize it. <laughs> uh, you can head in here. The room is safe, but there's some clothing. It does not fit. There's one outfit that fits you perfectly. Can you change your outfit? Sure. This is very uncomfortable sounding. Done, Chris? Probably. And we have that as an outfit, but I think there is one more. At least I think so. It would be this one. The Maiden Heaven. So pretty much I think is the, it's an alternate outfit or a Sons of Anarchy slash Hell's Angels kind of outfit. Obviously, I'm not here for the alternative outfits. Just saying. But this, this is Chris. Fuck yeah. What's here? There's some extra ink ribbons. There's some herbs. I'm actually gonna use one or two of these, depending. Yeah, so we're on yellow fine. I'm gonna just bring it up to green. Refresh the health. I don't, I don't have to, but I'm not really gonna come back here. Not unless I decide to have a change of heart of what I'm wearing. But yeah, this room was pretty revolutionary for its time. It had a mirror. Right. We gotta find what else uses this armor key. Um There's still a lot of doors at, at on the right hand side. Problem is on the second floor we're limited. Uh, oh no, I believe that big door was a carving of an armor or a carving of a helmet, I don't remember. If not, I have another idea where we can go. Do, 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 there we go. Stop your big ass feet up there, Chris. You got this, Chris. Store? Yeah, armor key. I think there's only like one or two more doors, if I remember correctly. But in here, there's a simple puzzle. There's a button. There is a... What looks to be an emblem. Two statues. Do not press the button unless you want to die. Instead, move the statues appropriately over the grates. In fact, to simulate what's gonna happen, 
if you do not cover the grates, the room will fill with poison. So don't do that. Just cover them and hit the switch. Now, we have the emblem. Pretty ominous. Now, we know where that goes. Supposedly. And it's not where you think. The next stop will be a save room. Okay. Let's go see Jim and Tim. Jimmy! Timmy! Do you like my new clothing? Fresh out the closet. Hell yeah. All right. Let's head south. Yeah, <laughs> no. La, da, da. So we're going to put the shotgun shells away. The emblem, I think I'll hold on to. Python, I'm going to put away for now. Only three shots. I don't want to waste it. <sighs> Here, there should be some ink ribbons. Never mind. I thought I saw ink ribbons. Oh wait, stop it! I don't want to be ink ribbon trapped. Thank you. So... From here... We will go... If you see... There is... No way to get into that hallway as of right now. On the second floor, however... There still is a door with a keypad. That one door, which I believe is locked with a sword. And by the way, we don't really want to... No, that's the helmet. And we don't even really need to go in there right now. Uh, that's for later. This is really Resident Evil helmet edi or map edition. But... I believe we want to head towards the doggy corridor again because the um the door on the side there I don't remember but I think we can open it I don't remember if it's a sword or armor Uh, I almost got bitten and vomited on at the same time. That would have been very bad. On my new clothes! God damn it! Okay. Well, away we go! Let's head out to the pharmaceuticals room. Right, and let's just cross the ominous staircase. I'm trying to remember where the sword key might be. Because I think that's one of the that's the main key we want right now. 
Because we don't have a lockpick as Chris. Yeah, there's this hallway. I believe it was carving of a sword, but I want to make sure. Locked carving of a helmet. Oh. Okay. That changes my perspective. Carving of a sword. Locked from the inside, I believe. I suppose we... Still don't have the numeral, numeral password, right? Where key panel? I wish I could just guess. I know the password. But no. Chris is too dumb to guess. God damn it, Chris! In the world. Of survival horror. Let's try heading down. Yeah. And let's go to the kitchen. Actually, I am going to grab these. I do want a manual save because again, I don't want a save state to corrupt. Chris dash zero one dash M hall one F. Now that we saved, I feel a little bit safe. Just a little bit. Okay. Let's see. Locked. That room, that room, and that room. We don't have the plant herbicide. I imagine, oh, this is the gem room. I imagine the herbicide would have been probably in the pharmaceuticals room. But it wasn't. At least to my knowledge, it wasn't. Okay. Fair enough. didn't feel very good. Mm -hmm. Notice Rebecca's gone. Isn't that wild? I wonder where she went. No one knows. She could be dead for all we know. That wouldn't be good, really. Also, this music is the best saver music. Yeah, 
Yeah, so we need to find the herbicide. You know what, I didn't try the door that went over there. If I think, if I fucking said that we didn't need to go down there and there's something we need down there, I will personally bite my own tongue and just disqualify myself from being an expert at this game because I have played this game many times. As a kid and as a teen. Take a look. Locked from the inside. Okay, well, it doesn't matter anyway. What the fuck? There's like one door I'm fucking missing. Not that one, not that one. Not this one. Carving of a sword. I think the worst part is, is the keys are just ugh. That room is a helmet, and I know what that is. It's not that. We don't have the key key numbers for that. There is definitely something I'm missing here. When I said advanced mode was gonna fuck me over, I didn't think it was gonna be this bad. Maybe the dog hallway? That's like, I'm, I'm gripping at fucking hair strings here, but... Advanced mode is fucking annoying, man. Everything's all scattered. Where the broken shotgun was was supposed to be where the herbicide was. And where the... The Magnum was, or the Cold Python, is where the broken shotgun was supposed to be. <laughs> My brain is frazzled. No, it's carving of sword. Not stupid. Where is this elusive sword game? No, there's a thingy. Yeah, no. Nothing behind the stairs, although that would be really clever. Um. It wasn't that door. It wasn't that door. Can't be the numerical door. Can't be the door beside it. There's something I missed then. It's gotta be it. Um. I'm trying to figure out. I am fucking clueless. I suppose this is what I get for playing mostly jail runs.
There's no. If the statue has what I want, I'm pretty sure it was an emblem. But I could be wrong. Yeah, it's just an emblem. I don't know. Can I put the... Ah. Does that do anything? No. It literally does nothing. What the fuck? Um... I know the Jimbo hallway, it says it's locked from the inside. Room with the map to the second floor was locked with a helmet, I believe. There's gotta be like a passcode I'm missing or something. Jesus Christ. See anything? Just shout at me. Stop being a dumbass. I know. to take a look The Resident Evil I'm Lost edition. I'm lost. There's gotta be a room I forgot. Enter that one. That door is a helmet key. Back to gym. Okay. 
And the, the room that needs the wooden crest is locked behind a sword key. So is every other fucking room I need. Oh my god. Are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? God damn it. The one room I thought it wasn't. Richard from Bravo Team. 